Welcome to Believers Mandate. Please like our videos, share and subscribe. Thank you and God bless you. The problem we had when they started training us was that these ministers didn't share their experiences with us. They didn't share the things God told them. And so we didn't know. They just came, quoted scriptures, told us what to do, and we were doing it and we almost died. We didn't know the organic side. Bought suits, bought shoes that look like certain ministers. Walk like them. And at the end of the day, we never had their results. I can't tell you, 10 years ago, is it 10 or 12 years ago, if you saw my picture, my hair was permed. <laughs> you don't know me. <laughs> 10 years ago, I used to perm my hair like Pastor Chris. Then we walk like this. <laughs> if we are standing, this is how we stand. If we are walking and teaching, we walk like this. You know the Lord is in this place. As we are talking, the atmosphere will be dying. <laughs> Meanwhile, he is talking everywhere, he's charging. You, you are talking, the atmosphere is dying. Pastor Chris will just come. Whoever is in Christ Jesus... It's a new creature. You will now come and say, new creature. <laughs> Why he saying cripples are standing, you are saying it, people are sleeping. What is happening here, sir? It's beyond suit and shoe. There's nothing wrong with the suit. Learn the good things. Speak well, but have power. <laughs> have power. I now went and washed my hair and, and cut it. Because the warfare that was even coming to me, the, the favor and glory of my life was not enough to handle it. So, because if I show up, they, they reject me. Because I now bab the hair first. And say, wait, when I understand what this man understands, I can do what I want. But this thing is not working. <laughs> we now sat down. We started hearing the messages again. That was when we now knew the dealings of God on their lives. We knew dealings. Because the organic part is heavier. The organic. Heavier. The first time I started praying for the sick, we, we, we thought it when we shouted that the demons used to hear, Come out! When we do, Come out! It, the person will fall down. You will now walk like this. <laughs> Say, no, leave her. She's okay. With your low, bogus pride, the angels are looking at you. After a while, the rules changed. If you come and shout, come out. The Holy Ghost will now remind you of the malice you are keeping somewhere. How does malice affect the anointing for healing? Okay, Lord, if, if it's not about me, at least this person believes in you. Don't worry, another person will heal her. You are not the only person I'm using. <laughs> okay, Lord, how about your glory? These people are watching now. If this person is healed, at least they will know that you are God. They know. That's how we tried to deceive God for many years. We now discover that the standard of the law stands sure. It doesn't shake. It doesn't shake. That standard is sure. So don't run to God when you have a problem. When you have a problem is where you should manifest God. I will come for a healing service from the introduction. I will do introduction with 12 scriptures. Ba, 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 ba. 12. When I... That 12 scripture is a progression of healing. When I finish, then I'll say, okay, let's begin with the Bible. I will now teach for one hour. I say, that is introduction. Let's start. When I finish preaching, we will now say, in the name of Jesus, we will scream. When you say, if you are healed, wave your hand. You will look from left to right, from front to back. No hand is up. You will now say, let's worship God. <laughs> let's worship God first. Maybe they've not heard. You will worship God for 10 minutes and come back. Raise your hand. Somebody will now notice that Kai, this man of God is about to be embarrassed. At least for his boldness. Two people will come out and say, I had a headache when I was coming. I don't know. I can't feel it anymore. <laughs> Kai! Because they will notice that ah, your face was glowing. Sweat now. The frequency of sweat coming down has increased. How come you're, you are not looking so wet? Veins. They are noticing veins on the screen. They will now say, 
Yesterday I ate something. I was purging. Now I don't, I don't feel it anymore. Where is the pain? It's somewhere here. Even the person doesn't know where the pain. <laughs> they want to help you. And then sometimes the, the interpreter, God seven, there is a miracle here. What happened? <laughs> he said he had a headache. But when he came in here, the headache disappeared. <laughs> Headaches don't disappear. Now are you seeing it? <laughs> Pastor, sir! The whole hall will be shaking. What is the testimony? <laughs> there was stomach pain. It has been there since morning. Uh-uh. The service is in the evening. <laughs> I now discover this thing is beyond quoting scriptures. It's beyond quoting. How does it work? How do we manifest God? He said the hands must be clean. Because the healing service began when you went to the office. The healing service began when they confronted you with bribe. The healing service began when you had issues with that person. And you went to speak evil of that person. And the Holy Ghost was moved in your heart. Troubled you. Keep quiet. You lied against that person. The Holy Ghost said no. Say the truth. And you kept quiet. You can't go up. The healing service doesn't begin two hours to the meeting when you knelt down and you are speaking in tongues. Speaking in tongues. No. It began when one week ago when you were walking about. That's called a clean hand. People don't know how spiritual things work. We think we can bribe God. You want to go for, you want to go for a job interview. You roll from one end of your door to the other side. You roll from that side and come back. You roll again and go back and say, God, I love you. I love you. Lord, do this and take the glory. It's not through your life only that it will be proven that God is God. From ages past, the whole universe knows that it's God. We want, we want to manipulate God. We want to use God. When you are a baby, He will look at you and encourage you. Maybe one time, two times, three times. When you start growing, that thing will stop. Work. We think we can bribe God. You want to go for you want to go for a job interview. You roll from one end of your door to the other side. You roll from that side and come back. You roll again and go back and say, God, I love you. I love you. Lord, do this and take the glory. It's not through your life only that it will be proven that God is God. From ages past, the whole universe knows that it's God. We want to manipulate God. We want to use God. When you are a baby, he will look at you and encourage you. Maybe one time, two times, three times. When you start growing, that thing will stop. 